Hi, my name is Ismail Kruby Garcia, and I'm here to present an incomplete history of research ethics, a collaboratively built resource compiling stories from our past to gain insight into research ethics and inspire research projects to be more responsible and thoughtful. <clears throat> a bit about the project's origins, I used to manage the research ethics committee process at the Adam Turing Institute, where I faced continuous requests for training materials on data ethics. And since May 2021, I have been collaborating with the Ada Lovelace Institute to produce recommendations for research ethics committees working in AI and data science. One of our findings is precisely what I encountered at the Turing. There is a need for case studies to help researchers reflect on the ethics of their work. Some incomplete history of research ethics provides just that. Historical examples where people of all walks of life and in diverse institutions have faced moral and philosophical quandaries similar to those we face ourselves in modern day research. For example, there's a case of Haber and Sornetta embedding a moral code into the early forms of blockchain technology. There is the earlier case of Florence Nightingale, who in the 1850s used data visualization techniques to explain the different causes of death during the Crimean War. And then there is a case of mapping the globe with the Mercator projection that in 1569 would shape distorted views of the world map, showing that mathematical assumptions can have political implications. The project is run collaboratively on GitHub. All contributions are acknowledged, and I encourage you to read through its protocols, leave thoughts on open issues, and reach out to me by LinkedIn or Twitter at Hermeneuticist. Thank you.